Hey guys, today I'm here to give you guys a quick little overview of all of the essential oils that I've been using, which ones I'm using, what I use them for, how I use them. So I've been using essential oils for about a year now, maybe a little bit over a year. And it actually took me a while to get used to them, to remember that I had them. And I'm definitely, I would say I'm in the middle of, what am I trying to say? Um, I definitely like using them, but I'm not like a freak about using them for every little thing. I definitely still use medicine and over-the-counter things, and I use a lot of my oils for diffusing. You can see River up here. Um, for diffusing, and I'll share all of that with you guys. So I'm not an expert at this, but I definitely do use them, and a few of you guys have asked about it, so I figured I would share with you what I have and where I got them from. Um, so let's just get right into it. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys is actually in this drawer right here. I got these off of Amazon and I love using them. They're little roller ball things. Like, you know, when you get perfume and you can roll them on your wrist. Um, so you can put your oils in this to use them to roll on your wrist. You can roll them on your kid's feet. So you can see the little ball and the top. And so I just have a few of those that I like to use. I think this one is Four Thieves. I'm like trying to find all my stuff. I should have done this before the video started. And then I use this carrier oil. Some essential oils you have to use a carrier oil for. You cannot put directly onto your skin because it'll burn or I don't know why, but you have to have um, I told you guys I don't know much about this, but you have to have a carrier oil. So I have this grapeseed oil. I get most of my essential oils from Eden's Garden, and that's where this carrier oil was from as well. So with the roller balls, you can put in the grapeseed oil and then like three or four drops of your essential oil, and that'll work great. You can also use a carrier oil if you're trying to make like a lip chapstick or um, anything like that. So. That's the grapeseed oil is the one I chose. They have all sorts of different carrier oils. You can also use coconut oil to just add a few drops to coconut oil and that's really good chapstick. And this one is lavender. So this is a lavender roller ball. You can roll it on your temples. You can roll peppermint on your temples to help headaches. All sorts of different things that you can use your essential oils for. So now I'm going to get into the actual oils that I have. And again, I'm going to tell you guys what I use each oil for, but there's so many different uses for them. And then you can combine them. There's just so many different things. So I'm sorry if I skip over different things, but, um, so I got this little six pack from Eden's garden. And these oils seem to last me a very, very long time because I definitely bought these over a year ago. So there's six oils in here. There is eucalyptus. There's peppermint. One of my favorites, lavender. There is lemongrass. There is sweet orange and tea tree. So I'm going to go through each of these to tell you what I use them for. Eucalyptus is really good when you have a cold to put it in your diffuser. It helps you breathe better. You can put it on a roller ball, roll it right under your nose. Um, it definitely clears up your sinuses. Again, there's so many other reasons to use this, but that's what I use it for. Peppermint I use for headaches. I actually don't like peppermint too much, but definitely for a headache under your nose, on your temples, headache will go right away. Lemongrass is really good for your bath. You can um, drop a few drops into a bath and it helps relax and also is really good for acne. And then lavender is good for relaxation as well in your bath or just spray it in your room. You can use just spray, put it in a spray bottle and spray it around. Um, and I also diffuse that one a lot. I honestly don't really like the sweet orange, but that's a good to mix with others to just have a good scent in the house in the diffuser. And then tea tree is really good with acne as well. And it's also good with fighting viruses. Speaking of fighting viruses, I also have three from all from Eden's Garden um, blenders or whatever they call them, blends. These are different oils all blended together. These six are just their plain oil. 
no blends and then I have these three blends so the first blend I have is stress relief I love the smell of this one I definitely do it in the diffuser mostly bergamot patchouli blood orange ylang ylang and grapefruit essential oils are in this one so it's nice to have a blend so you don't have to buy all of those and try to figure out the mix for it I think everyone's heard of Four Thieves. We do everything with Four Thieves. We roll it on the kids' feet, we diffuse it. It's really good with fighting sicknesses and viruses. It's cinnamon, clove, eucalyptus, lemon, and rosemary all together. And the good thing about this one, it recommends like the delusion that you need to have if you're gonna put it like in a roller ball or something, it has that on the back as well. And then this one, Align, you guys know I've been dealing with some anxiety and stress, so I like this one for that. It's frankincense, rosewood, spruce, and tansy and woodsy. Wait, tansy is woodsy, warm, and clear. Created to bring a daily sense of calm and well-being for moments of anxiety and unease. So I do this for the kids too in the diffuser. I'll show you guys my diffuser. I just keep it on the kitchen counter. I move it around the house sometimes. I'm definitely thinking about getting one each for the kids' rooms. I just don't want the kids to mess with it too much. So haven't done that quite yet, but um, I like the diffuser that I have. Um, I also have this doTERRA oil. It is also for thieves. This is our roller ball, and I also have a roller ball of my own of four thieves. But again, I just roll it on my wrist or on the kids' feet or on their wrist. And then um, it's called On Guard for doTERRA, but it's for thieves. There are these little beads that you can actually eat or take kind of like a pill. Um, they're very interesting. So if you're sick, you have a cold or something, I don't know, can you guys see? They're like little beads with oil in them. So pretty cool because you can also um, mix all the, not all these, you can mix some of these with water and drink these oils. Um, so that is all the oils that i have these are the ones that i use all the time i'm definitely about to go back onto eden's garden i'm not sponsored by them at all I, this is just the ones that i like to use um, to get some new oils so maybe i'll do an updated video once i get those and start using those a lot um, there's just so many things that you can use them for and I really enjoy it. I definitely recommend that you do your research, especially for anything that you're going to put on kids or around kids. Um, the blends that you need to do or the delusion that you need to do with the carrier oil so that you don't burn your skin or hurt yourself. And um, definitely just know what you're doing before you like ingest an oil or anything like that as well. So um, just a little... Thing there before I get in trouble um, but those are the oils I like to use I hope you guys enjoyed this video leave down in the comments any questions that you have and I'd love to answer them let me know what your favorite oil is and definitely let me know what your favorite blend is for the diffuser that smells great I'll see you guys in my next video bye